Nikki is asking with the new digital LSAT, how might the test writers, meaning the test takers, I assume this person's Canadian, be able to strategically choose a question order? Do you think it would take too much time to go through the questions, figure out which order to do them in, write down that question order, perhaps on a piece of paper, and then complete the questions in that order? Yeah, I do think that would take too much time. Definitely, if you're going so far as to write down that question order, the test is very strictly timed. It's actually unreasonable to be able to do everything in the time allotted, which is why the test is so difficult for so many people. So you've got a big time crunch. Don't waste time choosing the order. Just do things in the order given. If you encounter a difficult question, you might want to flag it, skip it, hope to come back to it later. And if that's an issue for you, which it is for many people, really do work on your pacing. And yeah, if so, so basically, if you encounter something difficult, skip it, come back to it. That's really the major way in which I would adjust question order. I've also talked at many different times about doing logic games questions within a game in a certain order or logical reason or reading comp questions within a passage in a certain order. And that might involve a little, a, a little bit of skipping around, but I wouldn't actually write down the order and jump around in that way in terms of difficulty. I would skip things, come back to them within a game, within a passage, but that's as far as I'll go on that. I wouldn't go through and say, okay, well, I'm going to do game three first, then game two, then game four, then game one, or reading comp passage one th third and reading comp passage number two fourth and such. That just gets way too complicated. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.